nation has lost yet another black trailblazer. Lee Elder shattered barriers in golf world as the first African American to play in the Masters. The PGA confirms he died yesterday. Tiger Woods once said Elder paved the way for guys like him. He called him the first, the one he looked up to, but it did not come easy. Lee Elder was orphaned at nine years old, dropped out of high school in the 10th grade. He broke into the game in the civil rights era when black golfers were still unofficially barred from the Masters. Elder finally qualified for the tournament in 1975. He was 40 years old then. In the run-up, he says he faced death threats, harassing phone calls, and at one course was even forced to change clothes in the parking lot because he and other blacks were not allowed in the clubhouse. It didn't, he didn't make the final cut for that Masters in 75, but on his last hole, Elder recalled that most of the staff, all black, left their duties to line up for him on the 18th fairway. Lee Elder told Golf Digest in 2019 that on that day, he could not hold back the tears, and that of all the acknowledgments of what he's accomplished, that one meant the most. Lee Elder, golf great, was 87.